Hey guys, it's Joe Cicciarella, broker with Real Estate Homeward. Now, after selling real estate for over 10 years, I put together a list of the top five things you should be doing to maximize your sale price before putting your home for sale on the market. Now, there are things like kitchens and bathrooms, you may have heard already, that will get you some of the best returns on your money. However, they are also some of the most expensive things to do. So for the purpose of, of this video, I've put together a list of the top five things you should do without breaking the bank. So starting with number one, decluttering and depersonalizing your home. So what does this mean? It means putting away all your personal belongings. So things like your kids' toys, if you have kids' toys, any personal photos or religious belongings, keep them out of sight and out of mind. If you're able to rent a storage locker, fantastic. Otherwise, if you have a garage or a shed or even your closets that you can put them in, stack them up neatly and tidy and, and, and uh, keep them out of sight, out of mind. Number two is the lighting. Lighting is so important. I can't tell you how many times I've walked into a property and gone down to the basement, for example, to turn the switch on and the lights don't work. So we got to get out our cell phones, basically walk around. Don't do that. Make sure all your lighting is working inside and outside. Here in Canada, you know, when the winter time comes, it gets dark pretty quick after 5 or 6 p.m. So those exterior light bulbs, make sure those are working too. Number three, make sure your house is clean. What do I mean by that? It means make sure all your dishes that are, are out of the sink, all your windows and doors, you can see through them clearly. Um, countertops, caulking around the showers and bathtubs, for example, and the sinks. And also the smell in your home is also... Uh, reflection of how clean it is sometimes so when if you're a heavy smoker smoke outside for the time being make sure it's aired out or if you cook with heavy spices you're going to want to tone it down a little bit and appeal again to the most amount of buyers looking number four is very important as well and that's your exterior of your property make sure your landscaping and uh, things like your lawn your driveway, it's all clean, well-maintained. If you have oil stains, you may want to repaint your driveway. If you have a lawn, make sure it's mowed properly and your hedges are trimmed, for example. Basically, when a buyer drives up to your property, that is the first thing they're gonna see. And they're already getting an impression of how your inside is just by looking at the outside of your property. So make it a positive one. Last but not least, it comes down to painting. Painting is so important, it gives your your house a whole new look, especially if it's outdated painting or wallpaper that's not really in style, it can really freshen up the place. So if you're not too sure what colors that you should be going for, feel free to reach out to us and we'll put you in touch with some of our designers and give you some pointers on what colors ideally will work best in the current market. Having said that, those are your top five things you should be doing to your house to maximize your sale price. If you guys have any questions or if you're looking to buy, sell, or lease a property, reach out anytime and we'll be happy to help. Until next time, stay tuned for the next video. Cheers.